بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم اسٹوڈنٹس ٹوڈے وی ہیو ٹاپک اباؤٹ ہیومن اسکریٹی سسٹم دا ہیومن اسکریٹی سسٹم یوز ٹو ڈسچارج میٹابولک ویسٹ فرام دا باڈی سم آف دا میٹابولک ویسٹ وچ آر پروڈیوس ان دا باڈی اینڈ دیئر سورسز آر discussed here urea is produced from the metabolism of the amino acids and uric acid is produced from the muscle creatin bilirubin is the metabolic waste and the source of the bilirubin is the end product of the hemoglobin and various hormones and the red blood cells break down and the discharge of the metabolic waste of the red blood cells is considered as bilirubin some pesticides drugs and food addictives are the sources of these are ingested into the body and similarly some of the toxic material which are produced in the body and ingested into the individual body or system initially we have seen that there are two main primary structures which are used to eliminate the waste products first is the liver and the kidney in the previous lecture we have discussed in detail about the liver we will we will discuss here the importance and the system which are related to the kidney known as the human urinary system a pair of kidney are located against the dorsal abdominal wall the right kidney is little lower than the left kidney left kidney little bit on the higher side here's the diagram which shows the location of the kidney left kidney is on the above side right kidney is on the little bit on the lower side here the rota which provide oxygenated blood to the kidney through the renal artery and receive deoxygenated blood through renal vein from the kidney a urine will collected in the kidney in a pelvis area and discharge through the ureter and here urine will enter into the bladder like portion known as urinary bladder and finally it will be discharge out to the urethra both the kidneys are protected by thin membrane and by some fats which are deposited around the kidney and protected from the injuries in the human kidney are the bean shaped paired organ situated behind the vertebral column vertebral column is the backbone in the abdomen at the 12th thoracic to the third lumbar region thoracic vertebrae are the chest vertebrae while the lumbar vertebrae are the backbone vertebrae lumbar and sacral vertebrae are the main backbone vertebrae every size of the kidney if we will measure it we come to know that it is 10 to 12 cm in the length 5 to 6 cm in the width and 3 to 4 cm in the thickness as well the weight is concerned we see that 150 g in the male and uh, 135 g in the female the weight of the kidney is considered 
this is the internal structure of the kidney very well diagram kidney divided in two portion outer portion is known as the cortex while inner portion is known as the medulla cortex is also called renal cortex or we can say that renal medulla here blood is entered into the kidney to the renal artery and discharge out or the deoxygenated blood move out from the kidney to the renal vein pelvis is a area it is considered pelvis is the area it is a funnel shaped structure and it collect the urine drop by drop and from the ureter it will move toward the urinary bladder if you see the longitudinal section the outer portion is the cortex which is darker region and inner portion is medulla which is in the inner side of the kidney and lighter in the region these two portions are present in the kidney and pelvis is the in the central cavity of the kidney in the central region of the kidney which collect urine and ureter collects the urine from the kidney and through a duct through a tube it will go toward the urinary bladder and from the urinary bladder the ureter of the both kidney drains the urine into the urinary bladder through the orifice orifice is a pore through which urine will enter from the ureter into the urinary bladder urine will leave the body during the process of urination through the urethra urethra is an organ in both male and female which is used to discharge the urine sphincter muscles are present near the junctions of the urethra and the bladder control the urine and according to requirement it is discharged out from the body is another diagram let's focus over here outer region is known as the cortex inner region is medulla is the pelvis like structure is present which collect urine and from the duct or the tube known as the ureter it drains the blood into the urinary bladder here the human urinary system complete diagram with longitudinal section or internal structure of kidney also represent the clear elaboration and easy understanding a pair of kidney is present on the anterior side of the kidney adrenal glands are located blood will enter into the kidney through the renal artery and deoxygenated blood will enter into the renal vein and from inferior vena cava it leads toward the heart the cortex is the outer portion of the kidney medulla is the inner portion and pelvis is present is here to receive urine and finally urine will enter into the tube like structure known as the ureter from the ureter urine will enter into the urinary bladder and from the urinary bladder urine will be discharged out through the urethra as well as the percentage of the blood is concerned although the kidney account for the less than 1% of the weight of the human body but they receive about 
ट्वेंटी परसेंट द ब्लड पम्प विद ईच हार्ट बीट एंड इन दिस वे अ ब्लड वेल रिमूव आउट मेटाबॉलिक वेस्ट इन द फॉर्म ऑफ यूरिन क्रेटिन क्रेटिन यूरिक एसिड दैट विल डिस्चार्ज आउट फ्रॉम द बॉडी इन द फॉर्म ऑफ यूरिन सो ह्यूमन यूरिन सिस्टम आदर द मेल और द फीमेल इट विल बी यूटिलाइज टू रिमूव द मेटाबॉलिक वेस्ट इन द फॉर्म ऑफ यूरिन विद दिस थैंक यू स्टूडेंट्स